You know, for a long time, I always kind of assumed that when it came to bees, you basically had only two different species, honeybee and bumblebee, and that was pretty much it. But here's the wild thing. There are tens of thousands of different species of bees. There are over 900 native species of bees in my home state of Utah alone, and zero of them are honeybees, as honeybees aren't native to any part of the Western Hemisphere. In fact, most native species of bees in North America are what are called solitary bees, meaning they don't live in a colony or have a queen. They often nest in underground burrows or pre-existing cavities in places like trees and reeds, and they don't produce honey or wax but drink nectar directly from flowers and spend most of their time collecting pollen. They take that pollen, mix it with a very small amount of nectar, and leave enough for each larva in their small brood to grow and develop on its own. Bumblebees differ from solitary bees in that they are social, building underground burrows headed by a queen. Like solitary bees, though, they also don't produce wax or honey. There are also hundreds of different species of bumblebees, each with its own unique look and behavior. Solitary bees and bumblebees are invaluable pollinators for native flowers and plants, and they're super rad friends, so give them all a big thumbs up next time you're out and about. Okay, thanks, bye!